Hey guys, let's talk about Magic the Gathering Online and what has happened with its economy since the treasure chest. A lot of people have sold off their collections. A ton of people are worried that a treasure chest is not the correct direction for Wizard of Coast to go with. And Magic Online, perhaps it is the, um, the expected value looks okay to me. Yes, it is very tilted uh, towards uh, the bigger hitters, but the EV looks about right to me. I think what is probably more concerning to a lot of people is the direction they're going to move towards. Uh, treasure chest seems a lot like Hearthstone. So one of the cards I always look at is you look at the Tamagoyf, and he has gone down $10 and are 10.29 tickets for the last week. And yes, it has been trending down lately, but it's still a highly tradable, highly valuable card. Now, his price is tanked. You might not be like, oh, you might say, like, oh, $10, what is that? Well, he only he began at $55 when the week started, and now he's at about $45 in some chains. That's a considerable drop. That is the 20 to 30% drop that a lot of these cards have undergone in the recent days. Uh, largely due to treasure chests, maybe somewhat due to redemptions. Uh, redemptions have been limited now, limited in time. So that's going to create a... I don't know what it's going to do, but it definitely will change how bots and how people react. And it's interesting because I can see a move to something like Hearthstone. And if that happens, obviously Hearthstone, the value of the cards are not as great. Uh, partially with some of the value... In, some of the value of the standard cards, and especially the random mythics that are valuable, is dependent on the fact that the sets are redeemable. Now, the redeemable period has been squished to um, much less time. I think it's six months for the first set and three months for the second set, where you can redeem it. Someone correct me if that is wrong. So you don't have much time, and that will create a... I don't know exactly what that's going to do, but it will do something, and it should affect prices as well so leave me a comment below and as always um, when people are selling you you should really consider buying i'm considering buying and you know i hate magic online but wow you know a 20 30 percent off discount on pretty much any cards you want or any decks you want even you have to look at that and say am i going to commit to magic the gathering online but, you know, I think prices have stabilized for the most part. So if you were to pull the trigger, it now would probably be the time. That's, of course, my opinion. Anyway, bye, guys.